Are you wondering why so many migrants are trying to come across the Channel, one of the biggest shipping lanes in the whole of the world? Well, it's because of this. It's because your government, the British government, advertises to these asylum seekers what you'll get. Let me tell you what you'll get if you're an asylum seeker in the UK, whether you're actually an asylum seeker or whether you were perfectly safe in France, for example. You'll get somewhere to live, a cash allowance or both. You can choose whether you want a flat, a house, a hostel or bed and breakfast. How lovely is that? I wonder if we serve it to them in bed. I do hope so. Cash support, you'll get £37.75 for every person in your household to help you pay for things like food, clothing and toiletries. I am actually reading this from the government website. Your allowance will be loaded onto a debit card each week to make it easy for you to spend what you want to spend. Isn't that nice? And even if you've been refused asylum seeker, you're a failed asylum seeker in my country, your country, you'll be given somewhere to live, and £35.39 per person on a payment card. This is what we're handing out. And then we go on to tell them you may get free national health service, such as to see a doctor or get hospital treatments. You'll get free prescriptions for medicine, free eye tests, free glasses. I ask you, as a British citizen, as someone that's paid in all their lives, do you get free prescriptions? Have you been offered a free place to live or somewhere that gives you bed and breakfast? Have you been offered £300 maternity payment just because you're having a baby? I thought not. These are people who are here often illegally and this is what we promised them. And is it any wonder that they choose to come? This country is a soft touch. It's time we started standing up for the British nationals who live here and our ex-service personnel who are offered nothing like this, nothing of the sort. In March 2018, close to 50,000 people were in receipt of these kind of benefits. Stop making our country a joke. Start standing up for our own.